Hi, my name is Mohammed and I run the blog called Dental School Coach. Today my goal is to show you how to write secondary statement that gets result. I know a lot of students that are writing secondary statement right now and they're struggling. In fact, when I wrote my secondary student uh, secondary statement, um, you know, I had to struggle a bit too. It wasn't that easy. Some of the questions are not that intuitive. And frankly, when the schools ask you, why do you want to come here? It's hard to answer. The reason it's hard to answer is because most of the school's um, website provide generic information that's pretty much garbage. They don't help you as much. 95% of the school website material are sort of fluffy, uh, generic BS that you can't really use. And the 5% are gold. So you need to know what information is important and what information is not important. And it's my job to show you how to write a great secondary statement. Um, when I was applying to Nova, uh, Nova South Southeastern Dental School, I submitted the AdSense application, but immediately right after I submitted my application, I had to fly to India. Um, I was doing a research project at a slum, so I didn't have much access to internet or anything. Um, I would probably go to a uh, internet cafe every once in a while, maybe within you know ten days or so. Check my email. So one time I was checking my email, I saw this secondary statement coming out of Nova, and they are asking me to write you know all the generic questions that you know they ask you in secondary. Not not too many questions, three or four questions. You know why do you want to come here? Uh, what's you know why do you want to be a dentist? They're asking. You know, they're repeating the question. Um, basically, you know. I didn't know how to answer it and I only had about three or four hours before I had to submit it. It had a deadline and now that I didn't have access to internet, it made it much difficult for me to finish my application. So I, read, I, I wrote something uh, uh, very quickly and I submitted it right away. The reason I had to submit it right away, even though I had about four hours, was that the internet cafe had an hour limit. So I was working for an hour so I had to get off the internet. Um, and the computer um, and you know in the slum there the computer system and the internet system wasn't that great anyways uh, when I came back to the US I got a letter from Nova in the email, in my mail um, and I opened it up and it's basically uh, a rejection letter now the, the rejection letter came in August which is very early on you don't expect to get rejected that early but I figured that because the supplementary statement wasn't as great um, I got rejected that's basically, you know, uh, why I got rejected from Nova. You hear the story when I talk about I got into UCSF, UPenn, you know, NYU, blah, blah, blah. Those are success story. Um, I, you know, I tell you about them because I want you to inspire by them. I want, you know, I want to inspire you through them. But um, when I talk about my failure, I want to talk about my failure. Uh, you know, I applied to 13 schools and I only got into um, five of them, five good ones. Uh, so rest of the eight schools I didn't get into. I don't have any regret about it, but I want to mention that, you know, it's a lesson. Um, I didn't get into Nova because I wrote shitty uh, secondary statement. So I wanted to take a lesson out of it. Secondary statement um, are as important as personal statement. Now, it's more important these days because schools are asking you to write secondary statement. Before, when I was applying in 2012, 2013, a lot of the schools just wanted to check. They, you know, before I left for India, I just signed a lot of checks and gave my mother uh, my checkbook so that she can send those checks to schools and I gave her the address. Um, some schools were asking for secondary. NYU, um, they asked for a secondary. UPenn, they also asked for a secondary. UCSF asked for a large secondary. Um, and Nova was another one that, you know, I had to, um, I had to answer when I was in India. Now, more and more schools are asking for secondary statement, which is very odd, but it's, you know, they have every right to do that because they want to be more selective. They want to cut you out of the application application pool. Um, so you, it's your job to make sure you write a great secondary statement. Having said that, um, how do you write a great secondary statement or, you know, how do you answer some of the, some of the questions? So that's my, that's my job today. Um, I plan to show you, um, you know, how to answer some of the most common secondary application question. All right. Without further ado, let me jump right in.